Hi, Scorpio. It's Elle here to do your mid-monthly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below. If you need to get in contact with me, let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Scorpio with a clear, concise message from you. All right, let's see what's going on for Scorpio. Let's see what's going on for Scorpio. What's happening for Scorpio? Okay. The Two of Cups. All right, so maybe you've met some mutually beneficial person. Yeah, the Sun card. Um, things are working out well for you. You feel like this is the one or... Um, this also could be reconciliation five of wands okay so maybe you have a lot you, you met somebody new it's going well you've and you kind of put all the other people to the wayside and now they're they they turning up like they texting they call and they want to know why you're not dealing with them and it could be because you have someone new the ten of wands here it's like yeah like cracking under the weight of your own success so you get all these people and now it's kind of um you know, it's a bit much to handle. Okay. Four of cups here. Uh, maybe you're just kind of like, you want to check out or you need to rest or you need to meditate or you need to figure out who you need to give your energy effort time to, because you have a lot of people vying for your, your time here. Let's see the five of cups. There is, um, maybe someone missing you. This is your energy. Are you missing someone? Eight of cups. So it's like, maybe you're just making moves right now. You know, but not knowing where you're going, you could want to reconcile with someone because you feel like they're the one. But there's, a, you know, a lot of pettiness and drama between the two of you. There could be some love affair also that, you know, either you're entangled in or the other person is entangled in. You could be in a relationship where you're just showing up for the relationship, but you're also kind of emotionally with, withdrawn. You've been hurt or you hurt the other person, you're not sure where this is going with the Eight of Cups, but you know that you might need to walk away because there's a lot of uncertainty, a lot of mystery, a lot of things not said or not spoken about. Um, your emotions are kind of all over the place here. It's kind of like you, you feel like you're wandering. You don't know where this is going. You don't know if it's um, working anymore, if it works for you, especially if you're in the energy of uh, maybe having a wife or a husband. Yep. If you are married, you're just not sure if this is working for you. You don't, you're not sure if you need to be doing something else with someone else. Ace of Wands. Yeah. It's, again, too much uncertainty. There's a lot of for forgiveness that needs to be had between you and your person. For things of the past, learning about things of the past, new people, other people, sexual activity with other people. So it's just like, um, right now it, it looks like the relationship is kind of on the rocks. You don't know where this is going. Uh, you're still engaging or you're still engaged or you're still married or whatever this is, but, um, it's like, it's make it or break it time here. This is what I have for you. If it resonates for you, go over to the website book there, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. Thank you, Scorpio, for being here. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Take care, guys.